Hello guys. Wait, hold on, someone is calling me. Hey Slick, it's me! <laughs> what the fuck do you want? You got my money, punk? Hey, you got some coconut water or something like that? I need some electrolytes. Damn, it's kind of warm, isn't it? <sighs> Man, you got a death wish or something. Am I supposed to kill you now? Oh, no, bro. Not me. Nah. Oh, yeah. But that's my boy. Yeah, but that's my boy. He has betrayed everyone he's ever known. He's got you involved with the federal government, and he's messed up several business ventures of mine. He has got to go. And you know what? I'd like to say that this isn't personal, but it is personal. But the feds, man. The feds have told me to kill Trevor, and I obviously can't kill them both. The feds. Steve Haynes, Dave Norton. I own shopping malls. I would not employ those two clowns in. And I make one phone call, their careers, they are over. So you're going to A, listen to some 50 grand a year pension hunter, or B, a billionaire, who even the president lets finger his wife, or C, try and be really stupid and save those two idiot mentors of yours and have everybody in the goddamn state crawling up your ass. A, B, or C, time's ticking, pal. Beep, 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 and your answer is... Man, you know what? Man, fuck you. Genius answer, pal. Total genius, but time is running. You think about it. Me, I got a triathlon coming up, and I am in deep training. Bye bye Man, fuck you. Kill Trevor. Kill Michael. That was... See. Franklin. Lester, dog. Man, we need to talk. I got a problem I need your help with. Man, actually, fuck it. Man, we all got a problem you can help us with. Calm down, all right? Come to my house. All right, I, all right, I'm coming. I'm gonna take this vehicle. Wow, this is about to roll car for the last mission. I'm gonna lose, lose it, I don't care, because this is the last mission, we need something special for it. And this car is so brutal that it's totally fine to lose it if it's, you know, game size, something like that. But I want to, because look at this brutal car, but you're gonna see it. I don't know where I found this, but I liked it and I was like, I'm gonna save it <laughs> for the special day. And this day definitely it's we're finishing. Grant that out of five people. Remember that. Of course I'm gonna make few more streams about this game. Really? When uh you know, I'm gonna finish the game 100%, so I need to mm, do a few things more. And then, uh, you know, about stunts and everything, that's all I need to do. Thank you, Nvidia. Yeah, I don't know why I said thank you, Nvidia. Here we are. The poor neighborhood of Leicester. Okay, they're not a problem anymore. 
Blaster! What's the panic, bro? What the fuck do you think? Man, imagine a fucking scenario that will fuck things up the worst. Boy, my mind is just racing. But you know, I don't want to say something that's really exciting, and then you have to act all deflated and say, no, no, it's just that somebody got the same tattoo I got. So why don't you just go ahead and tell me? Some motherfucker wants me to kill Michael. Some other motherfucker wants me to kill Trevor. I feel I can't kill both of them. Man, I'm fucked, man. I don't know what the fuck to do right now. Damn. Well, I can see that. Who are the motherfuckers? <sighs> Steve Haynes, uh, this angry motherfucker from the FIB. Yeah. Um, Devin Weston, man, you know the, um... Oh, that angry, that, um, rich fucker from whatever hole he hibernates in. Exactly. All right, all right, I say... Kill Michael, then kill Trevor. Oh. Man, are you for real? I, you're fucked, you know, I, I, I don't know. You know everything, dawg. I know, okay, but I, I, I'm sorry, I guess this is it. You know, I'm doing my best, man. I don't know how you can deal with both of them. I know, man. Shit. We're fucked. Every single one of us is fucked. Unless... Okay. Steve Haynes is under a lot of heat because of the shootings at Court Center. And Devin Weston is A, known to be a major asshole, and B, known to be friendly with Don Percival, who runs Merriweather. I think, actually, Weston owns piece of Merriweather. Right, 11%. Pretty good for a pseudo-liberal owning a private army. So, they would both love to be involved in capturing the bullion that we just lifted. If I tell them both that you boys are at the foundry and where you had heights melting it down, then maybe, maybe both of them will pay you a visit and bam, we turn it into a, a bust. I ain't got no better ideas. All right, I'm gonna get in touch with Michael and Trevor. You go to the foundry, get yourself set up. I got you. All right. Wow. This is gonna be crazy. What's up, homie? Man, things are kind of fucked up right now, dawg. It's all good, nigga. Who better to have in a fucked up situation than a fucked up fool like me? Man, that's what the fuck I wanted to hear. Hey, look, I'm coming to your crib to get your ass. I'm here. I'm picking up for more. If you're for real, I know just the end. How, what is gonna happen at the end? But now this, I'm not sure. I think I can never watch what is gonna happen here. But I'm interested. In your and the one thing that I ask myself all the time is, how could I? Finish the game, you know, like if my, one of my goals, you know, the things I need to do is uh, hang out with Trevor or with Michael, but I keep Trevor or Michael. Can't happen. There he is! Where are we going? We are uh, heading to the foundry place. Wow, I destroyed the car, man. Hey, look, hear me out, man. If it's too heavy for you, you can back out. No drama. Hit me with it. Man, we got a real problem, dawg. My boys, man. Well, we trying to save them. You actually doing something for your homies for a change? Hell yeah, I'm in. Who want to clap your homies? Who don't, nigga? Chinese dude, some FIB cast, the rich white asshole who scammed us on them cars. Devin Weston? That punk bitch? Why didn't you say we was creeping on him? We ain't creeping on him, nigga. At least I don't think he gonna be there. We gotta take all the heat he can throw at us before we worry about how we come. Oh! How we coming back on his ass? But you is coming back, right? Oh, hell yeah, we creeping on that fool. Oh, so you ain't the mercurial motherfucker you frontin' ass, huh? Man, I'm just trying to make something out of myself, dawg. That don't change who my homies are, nigga. It don't change my family. Shit, nigga, you getting me all emotional now. Nigga might have to stop me from sucking your dick, nigga. Look, man, Mike and Trevor, they should be inside. Can you stay out here and let us know when the bad dudes is coming? I got it, man. I'll holler at you. Uh, I'm entering the laundry. Hello, Michael Trevor. Wow, I don't remember. This could be it. Our showdown with a private 
private army, and you're bringing a rifle? Yeah, I'm bringing a rifle. It's a good gun. It'll get the job done. Oh, That's boys. Good. Hey, man, what the fuck am I doing risking my ass trying to save y'all ass if you just gonna kill each other? Hey, you're not saving me. You're saving him. Ah, oh, you're saving this fat fuck. Man, y'all gotta keep y'all fucking heads right and end this shit. If not, man, I'll put bullets in both of you motherfuckers. Hey, they here? I know them when I see them, homie. They creep. All right, good. Y'all hear that? Now, if we're doing this shit, man, it's either now or never. Come on, Trevor. Fuck it! Where do you want me? All right, man. You go over there. All right, where you want me? You hold your position right there. Okay. I'm gonna go over there.
There we go. There we go. Good job, team. Come and try. Are we clear? Yeah, all clear, friend. I think we're clear inside. Move into the access. Hold on. Wait for me, Uncle. There. I don't know. This ain't looking good for me. 
did I do this? Why did I did you do this? Someone to kill us, or are we gonna wait till this fucker gets turned oh, again, huh? Fight me, ain't anybody getting turned again, and you know it. Hey man, the way I see it, we only just begun to clean this shit up. We got a lot of old friends I think need to be re-educated. A lot of friends. I mean, things could get really messy. No, we just gotta silence a few noisy people. <laughs> what the hell yo, let me see. There's uh Steve Haynes. Dave Norton. No, we need him alive. Why? So nobody fucks with us afterwards. What about that triad motherfucker? The one that think you two boys is dating? Shit, you know he bound to come back. Yep, there's that. Well, who's the uh, the guy who set up Lamar? Hmm? Stretch? We want to throw him in? Shit, Trevor will throw anyone in just to satisfy his bloodlust. Whoa! Hey, it's called a fucking loose end, all right? Now, if we're going to be men of peace and tranquility, we tie up loose ends. <sighs> Man, Stretch has been a liability. They were gonna have to take care of our old pals Devin Weston and Steve Haynes. Oh, fuck, what a mess, man. Well, let's get it cleaned up. How about you get Lester on the line? Who is this? Uh, stop calling this number. Hey, it's me, dawg. <laughs> You're alive. I thought someone might have your phone. No, nah, no, nah, but look, I got you on speakerphone. Oh, did Mike make it? Yeah, I'm here. And the other one? <clears throat> See you putting the ground, Wheels. Uh-huh. You, um, just calling for a chat? No, we got some work to do. Can you get us some whereabouts? Oh, I'll do my best. Who? Steve Haynes to start. And Devin Weston's ass. And uh, Wei Ching. W-E-I-C-H-E-N-G. Wei Chang. Wei Chang. And Franklin's pal, Stretch. Huh. Stretch? Yeah, man. Look, his real name is Harold Joseph. Okay, well, I can tell you that Agent Haynes is taping a show over on Del Perro Pier. Shooting permit came up immediately. Check it! Oh, I wanted to ice that fucker since the moment I met him. All right, all right. Ah, I got a signal from Mr. Harold Joseph's phone over at the B.J. Smith Recreation Center. No, I got him. I got him. Let's keep him clear of uh, known associates. All right, thanks, dawg. You got it. What you got for me? Tao Ching's credit card just bought a Magnum at the Beach Club in Pacific Bluffs. Okay, I'll go ask his ass about his punk-ass dad. When I find Mr. Weston, I'll send the coordinates. All right, good. Hmm. Not sure, not sure. Play as T, maybe. I'm bringing you down for Let's stick to them. We take out our assigned targets. Any deviation will lead to confusion and probably failure. We got one shot at this, guys. I got the best one, so I ain't taking anyone else's. TP Enterprise, main campus. All right, Ron. What's happening, Trevor? We're undergoing a transition. Oh, yeah? I think that Chinese problem might be taken care of, and there's money in the bank. <laughs> 
Well, the O'Neills are gone, and the bikers ain't showing up again. So we're rich and at peace. Long as the forces of corporate darkness don't identify us as a threat, there's nothing to hold us back. Yeah. I guess we're all out of excuses. So they want me first to Franklin to move, obviously. Hey, Lamar, that was above and beyond, homie. Ain't nothing above and beyond when it comes to the homies, homie. <laughs> A nigga just wanna be helpful, you heard me? I'm serious, dawg. That's hood. Mike and Trevor, too. We grateful. You a real homie, and I love you, dawg. You too, homie. You done with this bullshit now? Almost. A couple of loose ends. Aw, oh, shit. I know that voice. You creeping on some fools, huh? All right, nigga, we'll handle your candle. Lay low, my nigga. No, I can't to this guy. Oh, carnival! Uncle T, everything's perfect. I'm moving on Haynes. Les, see if you can patch me into his radio mic. I want a last reminder of what an annoying prick he is. Los Santos, a city of saints, a city of sinners, and nothing in between but the FIB. Cut! Ugh, this is crap. Who writes this bullshit anyway? Okay, all right. You got this framed right? Mm, yeah, you're looking great. Is the chin? How's the chin? Oh, sharp. All right, the audio's clean? Nice. Uh, well, say something. Uh, check, check, check. Yeah, it's great. Okay, fine. We're on. I'm ready. You ready? Speed. All right, let's do this, people. I'm a professional. Let's go. <clears throat> Hi, I'm Steve Haynes. Hi. Please, leave me alone. This is Los Santos, a city of cellular... The last great American melting. In our reality. What's really going on under the hood? This is a land of dreams. But sometimes those dreams turn into nightmares. Stop! Cut! Shay. What? No, I know it's really good. Just do a cutaway. No, I'll pick it up. No, I'll pick it up. I got something Hi good. There. Ready? It's supposed to be sunny this weekend. <clears throat> Rolling. That's Trevor Phillips. I need a team down here now. Oh my God! Guy, that's his name. He shot him. <laughs> I shot him. I bet we do that with the sniper. But this is fine also. Really fun. This was my profession. Really? Really? We have a visual on the target. <sighs> this was not fun. This 
This is not fun. This is not fun. Where we find me? There are not we find me. Stupid pricks. I'm ready for. Hey, Lester, I dealt with Haynes. You got a location on Devin Weston yet? Yeah, yeah, I do. A Merriweather team was dispatched to protect him in his house in the Tongva Hills. I say house, it's more of a. Yeah, whatever. I'll go up there and get him. So who we got, man? Stretch and Wei Chang are still in play. I got Weston. Get rid of Mr. Chang. Oh, that's cool, so. This tower took uh, boost target. Franklin's target, Mr. Franklin's gonna assassinate this Mr. Chang and yeah, Michael. I'm not sure. Hey, the old man's here. He's leaving the beast club. I'ma do it now. Whoa, whoa. This was the craziest idea ever. Like rich literally. Chinese guy. Let's go! You don't assassinate the old brick. Whoa. Whoa, whoa. It's not stunt time. No, I'm not closing. I'm not closing. I'm not losing them. I'm not losing them. I'm not losing them. I'm not. Because I'm fast. Because I have this roll car. Because you can. No, 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 no,
own car again. Austin. No, no, no way, no way, no way. You're not leaving Los Santos. Ain't gonna have no more triads coming after. We ain't gonna have anyone to sell super weapons to either, but hey ho! Who's up? Harold Stretch Joseph. Still outstanding. Hello, Stretch Joseph! Ultra Hungarian! Boy. Front, Joseph. Here we are. Trying to break the order of things. Please, a pair of bitches. Only pair of bitches that stretch tolerate are the ones that worked this pump all last night. Huh? That's bullshit. Who's this the Joe's up here? Oh man, that's cold, fool. You you here for me though, ain't you? Whoa. Hey man, he got stretched, man. Roll on his ass. Escape oh, shit. Whoa, these are balls. Kill the ball is gone. Sweet Jesus! Don't fall in heaven! Wow. Do I have bullets on my team? I'm clear. Your pal Stretch? He ain't a problem no more, Frank. Shit, he wasn't my pal. He was a dude who ganked us, homie. Thanks. So who we got, man? I'm picking up Devin Weston so we can have some uh, fun with him. Now don't worry, I won't get started till we're all together. Not properly, at least. Oh, yeah. Trevor is gonna uh, go to visit this guy. No, this shit. is gonna be unbelievably good. Unbelievable. Believe me. Lovely. The risk of all visits. Hello. Wow. They has surrounded himself with Mayweather guards. Hey, unless you got news from the Foundry team, I don't want to be disturbed. I to kidnap you. Alright. Combat situation! Guard the asset! Wow, this was like... The worst. Oh shit! I'm a walking combat situation, assholes! You can't hide forever! He's after the W! Extreme prejudice! DW. DW. I'm getting kinda bored of killing you! They killed Trevor. Oh, what is wrong with my hair? Look at it. Hey, poor. It's not normal. Person, no you'll make to be stealthy. Yes. 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 
on the my way, on the rumble way, on the way of you play like humans, but I know you're you know. Grab that son of a bitch! Oh. Bye -bye. But man, your mansion is like huge! I love it. Show's over, I just put down half your outfit back in town! And we are from the bounty team! Get your ass back! How much is asshole paying you? I hope it was worth it! My boy Devin. Rick. Rick. What do you mean all our operatives are dead? You don't really Devin. Wait, wait, hear me out! Like I didn't know that you're gonna be inside, right? Yes. <clears throat> I'm gonna leave my beautiful, beautiful car right now. We are you got Mr. Try. Weston. Let's take him out of the city, make him disappear. Meet me on the cliffs off the GOH, Chiliad Mountain State Wilderness. Got it, got it. We're going to Finish the game right here in Mount Chiliando, Mount Chiliad. Yeah, that's Spanish. <laughs> okay, no, it's not. It's just a pronunciation. Not sure if I should. Maybe, maybe not. Maybe not. I do not. Uh, yeah, I was thinking about you know, take a shortcut. Just, uh, just. Where am I? What's happening? Let me out of here! Pipe down! <laughs> Don't worry! This is just a nice... You know, you're, you're a resourceful guy getting past those trained killers. I need someone like you in my organization. The CEO position's gonna be vacant real soon, Slick. I've got nothing against you, apart from the obvious hygiene issue. Michael caught me problem, so Michael had to go. You're looking at it rationally. There are people who are useful to you and people who ain't, and the people who ain't gotta go. Me? I'm not rational. I don't care if you're useful or not. I feel like taking you out, Devo. So that's what I'm doing. This is a serious problem. Work for me, you'll have everything you'll ever wanted. All I've ever wanted is to watch you drift in and out of consciousness as you're slowly disemboweled. Yes, yes, that's the kind of creativity I need on my team. Come on, come on, let me out of here. Look, I got my own company, Trevor Phillips Industries. Oh, yeah, a fellow entrepreneur. Let me buy a stick and give you money to grow. I don't know if you heard, but I'm kind of gold rich right now, so you got precisely nothing to offer. Prepare for the end, my friend. I don't lose! No, you don't lose. You do, you're just gonna die. I'm oh. getting out of here, and I'm coming for you! My friends won't be happy if I empty a clip into the trunk. Wow, Trevor has a, a really great number of tattoos on his body. Really, a lot of them. I told them I wouldn't kill you. I didn't say anything about cutting your tongue out. This is 
why people want to kill you. You won't shut up. The people I put in my trunk are usually dead. Yeah, and I understand you. Good tea? Never better, amigo. Uh, Franklin? I'll be here. <laughs> Franklin. Hey, right, what's up? I assume you got him? Ooh, safe and sound. Oh. Ain't that right, buddy? <laughs> hey, my bad, homie. I picked C. Ain't that a bitch? You know, Devin, the way I see it, and hey, I'm no intelligent businessman like you, but the way I see it, there's two great evils that bedevil American capitalism of the type that you practice. Number one is outsourcing. You paid a private company to do your dirty work for you, and then you underpaid that company because you thought you were big enough and bad enough that you didn't have to play by the rules. Oh, number two. Offshoring your profits. Offshoring? Oh, it's horrible. You wouldn't want to be sent offshore just to save a little money, would you, T? No, Franklin? I wouldn't. Oh, no, I ain't would going you nowhere. No, see, but we know your opinions on the matter, Devin. Keep your problems the fuck out of America, huh? <laughs> In this instance, when he puts it like that, it makes sense. Of course it does. Hey, Devin, goodbye, my old friend. Thanks for all the advice. Bye-bye. Let's pull this. One, two, three, goodbye. Boom! Bam! So now what? Now we keep a low profile and get on with our lives. As friends. Well, do I have a choice? No, not really. All right, then. As, uh, flawed, awful, totally uncomfortable, and poorly matched friends. Absolutely. Oh, that's perfect. Then we can get back to the kind of capitalism we practice. Shit, I don't know how much more better that is than Devin's con. Ooh, hypocrisy, Franklin. Civilization's greatest virtue. Jesus, your therapist has a lot to answer for. I know, I still hate myself. But hey, at least I know the words for it now. Yeah, but I hate you, and I know the words for it. So does that mean I don't have to go to therapy? Look, man, you two motherfuckers terrify me of that middle age. I'm good. You're right to be afraid, Franklin. Yeah. Be very afraid, Franklin. <laughs> Tell you one thing, T. I'm getting too old for this nonsense. Oh. So guys, so this is it. Look at my face. So. <laughs> so anyway guys, thank you for watching the video. What to tell you about this game, the best game ever for me. Personally, it's the best one. I hope you like this. Uh, I don't know. I'm gonna make a few more scenes about this game. You know, stunts and collecting letters and everything. I have a lot of job more to do with this game. 
but all the missions are over so my little review for this game is this is the best game ever for me like really everything was impressive it still is thank you thank you tomorrow new game Assassin's Creed 3 We're, we are still in America but in like 70s I think. 18th century I don't know so uh, anyway it's gonna be civil war and everything so thank you this is it the Greta Tata 5 is over you know the first thing uh, the first game I wanted to play when I started my channel like one and a half year ago was this game but I, at the time I didn't have a really good computer or PlayStation 4 to play and now I finished it finally I was waiting for this one since 2013 and now it finally happened so guys thanks for everything see you tomorrow in a new video with a new game I love you all bye bye have a nice day